we have a better chance of not losing homes, properties, or lives. Coconino County Forest Restoration Director Jay Smith and his colleagues are constantly looking for ways to decrease fire and flooding risks, but previous methods haven't always been that efficient. Enter the Char Boss. This machine can help us treat more acres um, and reduce the amount of biomass, uh, the limbs and needles that are left behind. That biomass has traditionally often left burn scars on the forest floor. But the Char Boss turns that biomass into a carbon byproduct that not only provides nutrients for various types of soils, it also has possible financial benefits through commercial usage. The cost of removing the biomass from the forest or from properties can get high and so having something that could offset that cost a little bit uh, helps out in, in being able to do more acres and more properties when we're treating uh, forested areas. But NAU professor and Ecological Restoration Institute Director of Forest Operations Dr. Hansa Pan says the Charbas isn't limited to benefiting forested areas and communities. It can be used anywhere, literally anywhere, um, but not just to northern Arizona, but we want people here in the southwest aware that tools are available now. Smith and Coconino County still aren't 100% committed to purchasing a char boss, which he says requires at least two people to run, but compared to the more than $100 million spent dealing with flood response and mitigation efforts after last year's tunnel and pipeline fires, he says technology like the char boss is definitely a step in the right direction. We have looked at this and said, wouldn't it be better to be proactive to try to get the forest in a healthier state, more wildfire resistant uh, or resilient uh, to where we're not spending money after the fire dealing with all these floods that impact our community. Smith says this is really the first version of this biochar technology. He says the county might wait a year or two to see if it gets more automated before purchasing one. They also might see if the Arizona Department of Forestry and Fire Management can potentially loan a char boss to Coconino County when they need it in at-risk areas like the Munns Park neighborhood just south of Flagstaff. Live in the newsroom, Elliot Policoff.